welcome back in this tutorial we will create one drawing based on what we learn in previous tutorial so we'll be creating this object so let's start with clicking on start mechanical design sketcher okay then select the plane now in this object suppose I want this to circle at distance of 60 so I will uh, at first I will create one axis from this point to this point and uh, I will press tab to give the distance of 60 press enter and click for the point direction so this 60 length line is created then next is this 82 and 56 so just pan it from here it will be 82 and from here it will be 56 so using constraint also you can give the dimension so this is 82 and this is 56 so after that I will create this circle dia 28 circle give the center point give the location constraint give the diameter of 28 so same way here circle you can also press the tab button so there is radius so I will give 40 So, just so these two circles are ready, and third is again this circle is again 28. So, circle endpoint again tab 14. Drag the arrow. So, these three circles are created, then outside three circles are of 27 radius. So again circle or give the circle directly or you can also double click on the circle to repeat the command and then constraint give it radius 27. Okay. Then next circle is this 30 radius touching this or tangent to these two circle. So at first I will create a circle. Give the radius. Okay. Constraint. Give the radius of 30. Then press Ctrl and select two object these two circles. Click on constraint defined in dialog box and make it tangents. Okay. Again select these two circle using Ctrl. Then again tangents. So this has been created. Then next is 83. Again this 83 is touching this circle and this circle. So again we will create one bigger circle. Take care that it will not automatically take some constraint. Otherwise it will not, it will not create it properly. Then give the constraint 83. Enter. Then press the first button and drag it and place it. So we want it like this. Then select the this circle and this circle. Press Ctrl for multiple selection. Click on constant defined in dialog box tangency. Okay. Again, this circle control this circle. Constant defined in dialog box tangency. Okay. Then next is this circle and this circle. Again, we will create 
those circles okay here we need to give it tangency so it automatically showing the tangency so we can take that then give the parameter 10 radius then control and hold this select these two circle constraint deep and in dialog box tangency same way here also so zoom it and you can drag the arrow again circle create it here make it tangent then again control select both of them tangency give the parameter 10 so in this way all the two zoom by pa zoom by mouse just press the scroll right click and drag the mouse so in this way you can zoom using mouse also so now i what the objects which are not needed will be, we can cut it using quick trim here quick trim or just double click on it so that you don't have to click it again and again for the trim command same way trim all the non required objects zoom it and trim it same way internal circles are not needed so we can trim those also and it and trim it then what is remained is internal circle from this line it is at 20 to 40 so from here again we will create one axis vertical axis and horizontal axis so this need to be 22 constraint 22 and this need to be 40 then the circle is of 20 diameter circle that is 10 radius zoom it so in this way this object is ready so thanks for watching we will stop here